Hello, this is Kaylee Gonzalez with MLC CAD Systems. And what I have for you is the process of how to grab the where used information from your 3D experience platform. So what I have open on my screen right now is I have my product structure explorer that's currently open with nothing in it. Now this can be found under your collaborative industry innovator roles. Also tiled on my screen, I have my Anovia bookmarks, which is my structure for all of my files and then 3D Navigate. So in order to grab like a where used of my assembly, I'm going to start out using Product Structure Explorer. So first thing I'm going to do is just drag and drop an existing assembly into my product structure. And from here, I'm going to go ahead and expand this screen a little bit so we can see this a little bit more clearly. So the Product Structure Explorer is going to give me a list of all of the specific physical products and 3D shapes and components that are inside of this specific assembly. So in order to grab the where used information, I want to grab the actual relations between these individual items. So going down into my action bar, I'm going to click on the relations. And this is going to open up the Anovia Relations app. So again, those are connected to each other. And this does look very similar. Now the Relations actually has a couple of views. I'm actually viewing this inside of the data grid view. So the default is actually the graph view, but for something like this where I'm going to start filtering through, I do recommend that you change this into the data grid view. So once my assembly has been loaded, next thing I'm going to do is expand all of the, the levels. And I'm going to just expand this kind of to the maximum value that this will allow me. What I'm doing is this is just going to go through all of the different levels and grab the relationships <clears throat> so that I can then filter through to grab only the, the physical products. So once this is done, I'll click OK. And then I'm going to go into my 6W tags and I'm going to go under Type and just click on Physical Product. What this is going to do is it's going to then show me only the physical products that are related to that top level assembly. And so here we can see all of the respective children features in here as well. So now that I have that open, I actually have another web browser on my other screen here that I've pulled. I found that this is a little bit easier to do from the web face when you are inside of just a web browser is to actually have two web browsers open because I find that the drag and drop is a little bit better. So I'm going to redrag that filtered physical product item into my product structure explorer again. And as you can see, all of these items are actually going to be those physical products. It's going to be that exact same list, which means now I can go ahead and export this out to an Excel file and that gives me all of my where used information and all of the children information as well inside of that particular assembly. So I hope that you found this useful. If you have any questions, please feel free to reach out to us at MLC CAD Systems and that's um, mlc-cad.com. Thank you.